What's up guys, it's your boy, the man, the myth, the legend, Pit Droppers, back at it again with the game of the week video, now in this video, I am the Kansas City Chiefs and, Ty and Tyrone is the Oakland Raiders. Now, this is definitely a very interesting matchup. This is for first place in the division slash wild card uh, implications. And this is definitely going to be a very good game. Whoever wins this game, I think, will end up winning the division. Um, I think Oakland does have the huge advantage, though, just because Kansas City still has a very uh, tough schedule even after Oakland. And so if Oakland loses, they still have a very good chance of making it. I just don't think they will. But it's definitely going to be something interesting to see. And it's definitely going to be a very uh, good matchup today. At least I'm hoping it will. Thursday night football. Hopefully it doesn't disappoint. Amari Cooper, I think, will have a big game. Uh, I think that Derek Carr will have a big game. I think the three main players for Oakland need to have really good games. They're three best players. Derek Carr, Amari Cooper, and Khalil Mack. Now, that's not in any order, but they are the three best players on Kansas City, and all three of them need to have huge games for Oakland to win. And then for Kansas City, their three top players are um, are probably, I would give it to Tom Bahali, Houston, and either Marcus Peters. You could arguably say Travis Kelsey also because he's Alex Smith's number one uh, target, and he's going to need to have a huge game for OKC to do stuff. And it's definitely going to be a very good game. Um, as I said in the predictions video, I do think that Oakland will win this game. I think they will win. I think it will be very close, though. I think Kansas City will definitely play very good defense. Um, that's probably, arguably, what they're best known for is their defense. And even though it's in Arrowhead, which gets super loud at times, arguably the second to loudest stadium in the NFL, I still think Oakland will be able to get the win. And the reason I say that is because Oakland has a huge advantage in the passing game. And I believe they have the advantage um, on uh, the receiving not just the receiving corps, but also the line. I think Oakland would win the defense line and the offense line battle. And I think that will be uh, Oakland's ultimate demise, or Kansas City's ultimate demise. Uh, and the reason I say that is because uh, Kansas City's defense has played really good, but their defensive line just hasn't been getting enough sacks. And their O-line has definitely not been playing good enough for Oakland to be able to win, or for Kansas City to be able to win games. And in case you guys don't remember, it was something like week three or week five, I think it might have been week five, where Pittsburgh beat Kansas City 43 to like 19, something along those lines, or 43 to 14, yeah. And that is just embarrassing. And Kansas City has definitely rebounded from that. And Kansas City has played amazing at home in the last year and a half. But I still don't think it will be enough to get them the victory. And I do think they will lose this game. Um, Kansas City, they're going to need Ware to have a huge game in the rushing game. And they're going to need uh, Jeremy Macklin to also have a huge game. And I think those are going to be their two keys on offense to winning this game. Don't think it's going to happen. And as you guys see, I am beating Tyrone 28-7. to You know, uh, to no one's surprise, I'm beating Tyrone, especially even though he has arguably the better team, especially since my defense is probably better um, and I'm mainly defensive. And you guys see Tyrone's just checking the ball up because he needs a quick score. And another turnover pretty much ices the game if the game is not already over. And you guys see there, beautiful catch by, I'm pretty sure, Michael Crabtree. That was just an amazing catch. Right here, though, I get the pick with none other, Marcus Peters. You know, who else would have gotten that pick except for Marcus Peters? Now I'm just running out the clock, trying to get the game to finish. That was actually really good coverage. And then right here, I decide to be an idiot and ride read option. I don't know why I did that. And then I go for it. Luckily, I got that 
great possession catch, and I end up winning this game 28-7. to Great game by Tyrone. And I do think that Oakland will win this game somewhere along the lines of 41 to 37. I think it will surprise people that it's an offensive shootout, but it's definitely going to be a really good game. So thank you guys for watching this video. Please like if you enjoyed, subscribe for a new one, write a comment down below on what you would like to see next. It's your boy Pick Droppers, and I'm out. Peace!